Hey guys, welcome back to the Giz Guide channel. This is Neil, and in this video, we're going to be checking out the 2022 Samsung The Frame TV and Lifestyle Soundbar. The Frame isn't the newcomer to the TV game. It first launched locally in 2017. It is a unique screen from Samsung's lifestyle lineup that functions as a 4K smart TV when it's on, and it turns to a work of art when turned off. True to its name, the TV looks like a picture frame thanks to its magnetic customizable bezels which you can switch up to fit your room's theme and aesthetic. In the Philippines, the bezels come in two styles, the modern or beveled, and comes in four colors, white, brick red, teak, and brown. What makes the 2022 model really stand out from previous models is its improved screen Samsung calls the premium matte display. The company says that this improved screen helps provide a more realistic art and screen experience. This may truly be a game changer, but from now it looks even better in person. I want to mention another upgrade to the frame is which is actually its remote control. On the front, you'll find a hot button to quickly access your favorite streaming platforms like Netflix and Amazon Prime. While at the back, there's a small solar panel to power the remote. That's right, you don't need batteries. In the long run, you'll save on money and actually help the environment by reducing waste. Samsung was kind enough to send us the 55-inch model to test out. It's also available in 43 and 65 inches and it starts at 58,999 pesos. Now let's switch focus to the Lifestyle Soundbar. This is the newest addition to Samsung's sound device category. It is sleek, lightweight, and to put it frankly, a beautiful piece of technology. Unlike other soundbars in the market, this one will make your living space more stylish, just like the Frame TV. This is why Samsung recommends pairing the two devices together. The Lifestyle Soundbar comes with a subwoofer and a remote in the box. It is available in color white and is priced at 29,999 pesos. Here are some of the notable features of the Lifestyle Soundbar. Number 1. Ultra Slim Design This soundbar is designed to be sexy and functional. It's a pretty white color, unlike other soundbars in the market. It also measures 116 by 3.8 by 3.99 centimeters and weighs only 1.4 kilograms. It is a welcome addition to any home looking to boost their home aesthetic as well as their entertainment setup. Number 2. True 3.1.2 Sound The speakers are equipped with 3 channel speakers, 1 subwoofer channel, and 2 upfiring channels to create a more immersive audio experience that allows it to be certified by both those Dolby Atmos and DTS Virtual X Virtualized 3D. Number 3. Versatile Connectivity The Lifestyle Soundbar can connect to the TV or other devices via HDMI or optical cable and wirelessly through Bluetooth or Wi-Fi. Number 4. Q-Symphony 2 When the soundbar is paired with a Samsung TV, the Q-Symphony is activated to sync the TV and soundbar speakers to work together for an even fuller and more immersive audio experience. In our experience with the combination, the difference is really night and day when you use the TV with and without the soundbar. Number 5. Immersive Performance If the media supports it, the True 3.1.2 with the Q-Symphony works together to offer an immersive multi-channel experience that emphasizes where the sound is coming from while giving the heart-pumping bass when needed. Number 6. Surprisingly good for gaming When plugged through HDMI, the sound and video are synced with almost no delay. This results in good simulation of where the sound is coming from. Video games where environmental sounds are critical to success will give players an advantage. This was seen when we played first-person shooters and we had to identify where the footsteps are coming from. This also helps in single-player games where the audio completes the overall experience. Our Thoughts the frame paired with the Lifestyle Soundbar offers a super slim and sleek TV and soundbar design that would be perfect minimalist centerpiece for any living room. We highly recommend this combination for people who want a functional yet stylish entertainment center for a small to medium-sized living space. Aside from the hardware, it delivers a smooth, user-friendly experience that makes it perfect for non-techie family members, while offering advanced features that the techies will love. When watching content on Netflix, I always found myself noticing how vibrant the colors are, especially when in filmmaker mode. I enjoy the crisp details in 4K resolution, and if I was in the market for a TV, I would highly consider a Samsung QLED. As for the sound, the Frame TV performs great on its own, but we always recommend getting a soundbar for your TV. 
The Lifestyle soundbar may be tiny, but its powerful 3.1.2 channel output with Dolby Atmos packs a punch. And with the Q Symphony, it really adds to the immersion of a larger soundstage and sound directionality. As we said earlier, the Frame TV comes in 43, 55, and 65 inches and starts at 58,999, while the Lifestyle soundbar is priced at only 29,990 pesos. Pros and cons for the TV Frame like design with art mode, stunning 4K at 120Hz refresh rate with equally stunning picture quality, fast and straightforward UI, customizable bezels, comes with view unlike Google TV, solar cell remote, lots of ports including eARC, HDMI 3, and HDMI quick switch. Pros of the soundbar Through 3.1.2 channels, Dolby Atmos support, easy to set up, and Q Symphony 2. The overall cons. For the best audio experience, you will need both a TV and soundbar together, which could be a concern for price-sensitive people. You need both the TV's remote and the soundbar's remote to access each other's settings. And you need three power sockets, one for the TV, one for the soundbar, and one for the subwoofer. Uh, but honestly, these nitpicks are very minor compared to all the advantages that you will get from taking the Samsung QLED and the Lifestyle soundbar together. Anyway, that's it. Thank you guys for watching. This has been Neil. I hope you found this video helpful. Let us know your thoughts down below in the comment section. For more tech news and reviews, you can visit us at gizguide.com and you can reach us through Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok. I hope to see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye!